It's the Ticket Plug. We've been running an online ticket business for over a decade, and now we've created an easy way for you to do the same thing through our private ticket resale community. Joining our community will give you a way to flip your bread and generate profit income consistently. We provide you with all the tools, training, and resources needed to start your life-changing online ticket business. Zero experience needed. To join our ticket resale community, go to theTicketTrap.com. Again, go to theTicketTrap.com. Click the link at the top line of the description to get started right now. Don't wait. Today, a video leaked of Little Dirk's 10-year-old son apparently allegedly shooting his stepfather and what people are now saying a domestic issue that he was actually defending the mother. I'm going to play portions of the video. Then I'm going to give you the stepfather that was actually shot. He speaks as well. And we got to break a new update. So All right, so here's take. part of the scuffle, and I'm going to, you know, edit out the actual shooting part. Take a listen. So Joshua Pippins, who was the stepfather of Little Dirk's son, put on IG. As you can see, I was not the aggressor. And y'all can see how I still had my gun on my hip. He grabbed my gun off my hip, following his mom lead, and tried to shoot me, then actually shot me. I'll advise y'all see it before you take it down. Um, so, look, th this is a wild, wild situation. A lot of people are deeming this little 10-year-old boy a hero. Um, we all seen the tape. We all can watch it. We all can kind of, you know, get our interpretation. I'm not here to play detective. It was obviously something going on. He felt the need to do what he did. Some people may call him a hero. Some people may think, you know, he was silly. Some people may think that he was crazy. The fact is, it happened. Um, now, a lot of people are, you know, I was, I was reading some comments earlier on different posts, you know, wondering if he'll be charged, if the kid will be charged. And I doubt it because of the nature of exactly, you know, um, really what happened. But it, it's just wild to see. It, it, but you will want, you will want your, you know, if I had a, I do have a son. If, you know, um, my son's mother was ever with another uh, um male or anybody that was aggressor and they were actually to do something you would definitely want to defend them um with force if necessary deadly force if necessary if they're of age Ten, you don't really expect a 10 year old to be able to grab a gun and shoot somebody you just don't expect that you know um so i'm almost at a loss for words it's like whoa let's just wait to see what happens to see how this thing continues to develop further on on and on now Dirk has not said anything yet he has not spoken on it or anything like that but um it is wild we're all waiting for Dirk obviously now um Pippins did go on to say he, he continued to say um listen nobody's going to jail or they would already been there I'm doing this for rights over my kids call me what you want and on top of all this I was at my mama's in front of my mama, granny, and more kids. I pray y'all make it through y'all situation that God going to put y'all through for playing with me. Because everybody's going in. Everybody's, you know, saying you was about to use attacking this lady. You was, you know, the DV and all that. You was going to do this and that. And only they kind of really know the ins and outs. We can see the tape. You could take whatever interpretation. It was clearly a struggle going on. But these are things that happen. These are things that, you know, it's not good. And, um, you know. It's just things that happen. We all know that. We all grew up either in a household or knew of someone probably, you know, what DV was going on. And it was just something that's one of those, you know, um, um, things of dysfunctional families that are just prevalent. Um, so, look, I hope the best for the situation. Hopefully everybody can get some healing. The guy that was shot, the young kid is going to be traumatized. The people that was around, because we, we forget the people that had to witness it, the mom, the little kids that was around. A gun is a very dangerous thing, right? It's very, and it has to be handled with care. He could have picked, took the gun and shot himself. He could have shot his mom. He could have shot another kid. He could have shot the mother. It's a lot of things that could have went bad in the situation. Um, in this case, he knew what he was doing. He took it and he aimed at the guy and he shot him. So. What do y'all think in the comment section? I'm going to digress on this one. It's a lot here to uncover, but what do y'all think in the comment section? Leave a comment below. Let me know what y'all think. Is he a hero? What do you think? It's your boy, Golden Peace.